today we are in Waco, Texas at Magnolia Table. And while we're waiting to eat, we are going to grab some coffee. Um, Daddy's ordering our coffee. I'm ordering a peppermint mocha and we'll let you know how it is. So we just got a notification that told us that our table is ready. Yes. So we're about to go in and eat at Magnolia Table. Yeah. They're 
It was good. It was good. And it's really good with the um, strawberry butter that comes with it. Um, anything else? The bacon is good. It, it, it does have more pepper flavor, but it's good. I like it. It's a I nice do too. Bacon. I do too. I like it. It is thick. And um, I like the potatoes. I would like some ketchup with the potatoes, though. Yeah. That's how I like to eat. I like crunchy potatoes. Oh, okay. So, I, I mean, if you look at the thickness of them, they're well, pretty thick. There's a soft inside yeah, and a crunchy soft inside. outside. Let me see if I can crack it open and just show you guys. Like, but I don't think it's just potatoes because it's... I think it has, like, maybe onions and stuff in it. So we are leaving a Magnolia table and um, highly recommend Corey. He is a great waiter and we have salted caramel. It was a really good meal. One of my favorite breakfasts I've had really reminds me of home, which means a lot because Delicious. yeah, my mom's pancakes are the best and they remind me of hers. So I mean, I recommend it. Oh yeah, Def definitely. I mean, I admit like, some people drive like eight hours. That's a little bit crazy, but we were yeah. already in Dallas and it was definitely worth that much of a drive for sure. But I mean, it's pretty cool, especially if you're like fixer upper fans and everything. And if you're not and you're in Waco, I would recommend it still. All these food trucks and stuff too. Oh, I love it. It's a Luna juice bar. Luna would love that. She loves anything with her name. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> the Luna juice bar. Second favorite food. So, again, we're going to go to the Yeah, the Luna juice bar. So, a guy was giving out free samples at the club sandwich food truck, and it's teriyaki chicken, and everybody really liked it. I couldn't try it because I was super full, but he was super nice, and they said that it was delicious. Um, they have a wide variety of things to eat here at these silos because they have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, wow. Okay, probably around nine or ten food trucks. Um, it looks like they have maybe like hot dogs. Yeah, hot dog house and then little briskets. So that's probably barbecue, pizza. pizza. A juice bar. Luna. Yeah, named Luna. Luna would love that. For the million. And then a sandwich <laughs> place that, I don't know, they have really good chicken. And um, a sweet tea place. I don't know what the other one is. They see something got hamburgers on it. So I think there's a lot to eat. Yeah, the tables are super cute. I'll show you. It's so cute here. And there's the silo. It looks like there's stuff for the kids to play on. Yeah, the kids. Maybe are like bean bags. Yeah, like bean bags and maybe like balls. I think it's just a greenery bean bag. Yeah, it's ball. nice. It's almost like a little tiny community park or something. Sturdy, sturdy swings. They're really nice. Yeah. Wow, that's heavy. We're not going to exceed the weight limit on this one. Well, <laughs> <laughs> that's good. I love this. It's, it's super cool. Stuff like that now, I guess. It is. Yeah, it's some kind of. If I'm being honest, I already liked the show Fixer Upper, but after seeing all of her work in person, I think I like their work even more. Is this it's so this cool. Is, this is something yes. Yeah, they designed like all of this kind of stuff. So cool. I don't know. It's just neat what they like came up with for this place. They're even on top. She has Wisteria on top. Oh, really? That's Wisteria. Oh, I love Wisteria. Yeah, Wisteria. We had Wisteria in um, our front yard growing up. A whole, like, huge holly tree. Probably. How old do you think that holly tree was in our house? What, sweetheart? How old do you think that holly tree was in our house? It was the largest in our whole area. They said yeah. they don't usually get that large. It was amazing, and it was covered in Wisteria to the point where we just called it a Wisteria tree. People would actually stop in our yes. yard and be like, can we take a picture at your tree? Yes, we had, when it was springtime. So, yeah, it was, 
insane. And so now every single time I smell wisteria, it just makes me think of home. And right now we have a magnolia in the back of our um, new house. So for me, magnolia and wisteria is just the smell of my house. That's a nice Jeep. That's a Willis Jeep? It's a Willis Jeep, yeah. A Willis Jeep? I've never heard of that before. But I'm not very like. Oh, it's a 53 Willie. I built the firewall for <laughs> Jimmy Bradley's. It's a white one. He had, a, he had one. You built what? I said I built the firewall for Jimmy Bradley for his 53 Willis. That's cool. I built the new firewall for him. He built his. His is white. It turned out nice. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, I might actually buy something from here because. I have a candle obsession. It's cute how it's a house on top. I know. It's, it's really cute. Yeah, look at that. It has a blue off the top of that one. Wait, what? It's so cute. It has a blue. Are they? I think these are real. They're real? I oh, know. No. No. no, they just look real. Because they have the bolts and everything. They, I was going to say they have dirt it's on so them. It's so cool. They're in dirt. Are there in fake dirt or real dirt? <laughs> it looks like real mulch. <laughs> no, I think it's real. Yeah, I was going to say, that's what made me think it was real. So we got on the trolley bus and we have the whole trolley to ourselves! At Magnolia, the silos. It's been pretty fun here. Yeah, there's more than I thought. At the silos after taking the trolley and they have popcorn on this side and Jen says this is an auger or something. I don't know. It's really cool. I just love how creative they were with everything. And they have flowers. And if you did not go to Magnolia Table, they had a little food truck that's Magnolia Table. It's about half the menu. The good old days are still to come. Restrooms, and that's a probably like caramel apple cart. And that says cheddar box down there. And I saw drinks. This is pretty neat, not gonna lie.